Have you ever wondered where the rain comes from or how the clouds are formed? Well, in this video you will get all these informations. The planet in which we live is called Earth. It is also called Blue Planet as more than 70% of the Earth is covered with water. Water is very much important for the survival and existence of all the living things, namely plants, animals and human beings. Life is impossible without water. Water cycle What is a water cycle? The continuous journey of water that starts from the sea, rivers, lakes, etc. to the sky, then to the land and finally back to the sea is called water cycle. Now let us understand this with the help of some pictures and diagrams. When the sun shines on river, lakes or sea, the heat of the sun changes some of the water into vapor. The change of water into vapor is called evaporation. This is the first step of the water cycle. This water vapor goes up into the air and forms tiny drops of water on meeting cool air. This is called condensation. Many such drops of water together forms a cloud. On cooling, when the clouds become heavy and cannot hold the water anymore, they fall in the form of rain, drizzle, snow, snow pellets, ice crystals and hail. This process is known as precipitation. The rain water again goes into the river, lakes, streams, etc. This way, the water cycle in nature goes on and on. Water cycle is a continuous process of evaporation, condensation and precipitation. I hope now the question is answered from where does the rain comes and how the clouds are formed. And the concept of water cycle is also clear to you. Thank you for watching the video. For more educational videos, keep watching Kids Study Zone.